good afternoon to everybody. Today we have an excellent moment that uh, all the way from San Francisco, USA, we have uh, successfully uh, engaged Dr. Ferry Murad to have a very important interview about nitric oxide and B few products. Good afternoon, Doctor. Thank you for making time for us to interview you about nitric oxide and B few. You're welcome. Dr. Murad, uh, I have about 12 questions for you today. First question, please provide a brief background of your Nobel Prize discovery. I have been working with cell communication for many, many years. How do cells talk to each other? How, do, how does one cell regulate the biochemistry, biology of another cell? And they do this with messenger molecules. And we call those messengers neurotransmitters, hormones, cytokines, are given a variety of names. And when they interact with cells, they regulate the formation of other intracellular messengers. And I've been interested in these extracellular and intracellular messengers. And because of that, back in the 1970s, I discovered nitric oxide. And that's why I received the Nobel Prize in 1998. It's a gas, it's a free radical, it's a very important messenger that regulates a lot of biology in medicine. It has become very, very popular. Why did you choose LRG9 and has LRG9 been studied extensively? We learned and other scientists as well back in the 1980s that L-arginine was the substrate for the enzyme that made nitric oxide. That enzyme is called nitric oxide synthase and it converts arginine to citrulline and nitric oxide. It turns out that arginine is produced in the body, but it's not produced in sufficient quantities. So it's an essential amino acid. We have to have it in our diets to have enough of it to make nitric oxide. And that then has led to the nutritional supplements on the market in many countries with L-arginine and other components. That's how it all got started back in the 1980s. Dr. Murat, how does nitric oxide help in cardiovascular functions? Nitric oxide is produced by the endothelium which lines all of your blood vessels. And when nitric oxide is produced, it goes to the smooth muscle in the wall of that blood vessel to cause relaxation. And the blood vessel widens, the diameter increases. The blood flow increases to deliver oxygen and nutrients to the tissues. And the blood pressure decreases. That's its effect in vascular biology in, in blood vessels. But it has effects in other tissues as well. It has effects on the heart and many other tissues. Can you comment on the future of cardiovascular healthcare with the nitric oxide discovery? Well, the American Heart Association in 1992 declared that nitric oxide was the most important molecule in vascular biology and cardiovascular research. And the journal Science called it the molecule of the year. It's so important. And our discovery was in 1976-77. And today there are about 150,000 research papers on nitric oxide. So it has multiple effects in biology. It's become very, very popular and very important. How do health supplements containing L-arginine that provides nitric oxide help in maintaining health? The enzyme that makes nitric oxide in many of our tissues is called nitric oxide synthase. It uses the amino acid L-arginine as the substrate to make citrulline and nitric oxide. Arginine is produced in our body as a substrate for that enzyme, but we don't produce enough of it. So it's important that we get it in our nutrition. So nutritional supplements, if your diet is not adequate, are very important to continue to make sufficient quantities of nitric oxide. And that's why the supplements have become popular. Is it possible for us to increase the nitric oxide level in body without taking any L-arginine? The enzyme will not make more nitric oxide without the substrate arginine, so you need arginine. Without the arginine, it's not going to work properly. Why do we need to consume L-arginine as our body can produce some amount of nitric oxide. Because the, the body doesn't produce enough arginine. So we have to have it in our diets. 
we have to eat leafy vegetables and other foods that possess arginine. If your diets are not very good, that's a problem, so you have to take supplements. And that's why a lot of people, because they don't have balanced nutritional diets with vegetables and the other appropriate things to eat, that they need arginine supplements to make nitric oxide. Why would Dr. Ferry Mura choose the combination of L-arginine, tomato extracts, coenzyme Q10, beetroot and promignanate as the ingredients for beef fuel? Because the enzyme nitric oxide synthase, while it converts arginine to nitric oxide, it needs other cofactors. These are chemicals that are helpers to make the enzyme more efficient. And these have to be in the reduced state. And these other additions, these antioxidants added to arginine supplements, keep those cofactors in the proper reduced state and protect the nitric oxide from oxidation. So it makes it makes the enzyme produce more and it protects it from its degradation. For a healthy person, do you think additional food supplements such as beef fuel can be beneficial? Yes, I do. I think it, because most people don't have a good balanced diet. Particularly young people and older people are not nutritionally supplemented properly. And therefore, the supplements like beef fill are going to be very useful. Apart from checking our blood pressure, is there any other easy or effective method to know the effectiveness of NO after one consumed beef fuel? We can measure the oxidation products of nitric oxide in the blood and also the urine. We can measure nitrite and nitrate. But that's a, an assay that we do in the laboratory. It's a test in the laboratory. It's not something simple that we can do with patients at home. The best way with patients is to monitor their blood pressure because nitric oxide will lower their blood pressure. So it's a very useful monitor. There are other tests available, but it's not something that you could use routinely in the setting of a home. For long-term usage, is it safe to consume beef fuel as a health maintenance product? I think long-term for people who don't have balanced diets, it's very important to have supplements. And I think an arginine supplement with a mixture of antioxidants would be very beneficial, yes. Other than improving our blood circulation and heart health, are there any additional benefits that we can get from consuming beef fuel? Nitric oxide has lots of other effects. It has a lot of biochemistry, a lot of biology. It influences wound healing. It has antibacterial properties. It affects the smooth muscle in your lungs to dilate the, the, the trachea and the, and the airways. It has effects on the intestinal tract and the gastrointestinal smooth muscle. So there are lots of other effects of the heart, the kidney. There are lots of effects in biology of nitric oxide, not just the vascular effects. The vascular effects have gotten the most attention are very popular, but it does a lot of other things as well. Thank you very much, Doctor for having a great afternoon with us. Uh, your sharing just now was excellent. Uh, it will definitely help everybody to know more about nitric oxide and beef fuel products. Again, uh, we would like to see you again in the near future. Thank you very much for the lovely afternoon.